No, nah, what the oh, you, you old. Where the f you going? We're not about to do that. You trying to run away from your problems and no, your I'm responsibilities. Not to run away. I'm not trying to be in Bro, you shouldn't have been out here being a What the f you doing there? You talk about you're not trying to be on camera. I'm not trying to be out here raising a kid that ain't mine. You want me to be there be responsible for this kid and be there for this baby? But you out here f with niggas and shit like that? You got me f up. What the f are you talking about? You know, I know right? Hello, 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 and welcome back to another reaction video. It's your boy Bob. And judging by the title, you already know exactly who it is that we got on deck. And it is Judy. Got another Catching the Cheaters video we're about to react to. Boy, this is this has been a tough, a tough time. Unprecedented, unprecedented time where, you know, all the female it used to be the guys but now it's like it's more females than the guys these days so you know about the title you already know what we're about to get into let's get it all right dude how you feeling cool 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 you ready for this man yeah, you gotta be ready man Ooh. about to put her ass to this test she got me in the blender oh. i'm trying to figure out what the f going on i right feel now. it man i feel it Today we're replacing Jozark's pregnant girlfriend Sierra to the test. Will she pregnant remain girlfriend. loyal to him or will she trade him for another rich and successful guy? So, so if there was no kid, you wouldn't be here? Oh, not at all. Not at all? I'm just gonna find me another one. <laughs> I'm about to open the door right now. I'm about to let you in. Yo! This loyalty test will take place at this million dollar home. Our friend Isaiah is pretending that he lives here. Madeline will convince Sierra to come over, and when the time is right, Isaiah will ask her on a date, allowing Jozar to find out if she will remain loyal. So she hits you up saying that she's pregnant, mm. and it's yours. She's saying it's mine, but you know. You don't think it's yours? It ain't no evidence proving that. We together, but you know, we trying to solidify everything with the trust, so you know. We making it work for now. Being for, there for the kid is what's most important. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. If she loved, then I'll apply myself to the situation as a whole, and maybe we can make it work. But if not, then I'm gonna just keep going on about my way. All right, here we go. Power everyone's ah. devices with ultra fast, reliable internet for twenty dollars a month. My girl says she's pregnant, but I don't think it's mine because she'd be outside too much. We've had issues in the past, so let's set up a test on her. That oh, was a she'd crazy be outside too much. Sent. And after hitting him up and learning more, we found out that he makes music and she's a dancer. They met while working together, they dated for a year, and then they broke up. The entertainment industry as a whole, you know, as both of us being involved with different aspects of music and dancing, it ain't really worked uh, out. You yeah. know, trust and everything wasn't really working out, so gotcha. we decided to just break it off. Gotcha. A couple months after breaking up, though, Josar and Sierra would reconnect on a night out. I was doing my went to for like four months and I caught her in the club again we made our connection but we kept it platonic after that and she hit me up like a month later and said she had a baby so it was like and it's yours she's saying it's mine but you know you don't think it's yours it ain't no evidence uh, no. proving that she been it's outside so hypothetical because you know we did have our consensuals but she could have been doing that with anybody and at the end of the day I caught her at the true, club so true, you know how true. you you out enjoying yourself I was just probably her option for that night I'm just trying to make sure that it wasn't others before me after telling him that she was pregnant, Sierra told Jozart that they should try to work things out between them, that they should try to be a family for the baby's sake, and Jozart's huh. down for See that. The, dog in the, back. the baby is his. She came back into your life and said, I got a baby and I want to make this work. What did you say to her when she said that? Really? Are you sure? That's the first thing, of course, or are you sure? And then, is it mine? But you know, it's kind of always going to throw the situation left and into the bad light when you accuse her of Yeah. We together, but you know, we trying to solidify everything with the trust, so you know, we making it yeah. work for now. Jozar and Sierra initially broke up because of trust issues, so of course there's gonna be doubts. Hopefully those doubts go away though with this loyalty test. And I'm not gonna lie, I was very hesitant about doing this video, primarily because there's an innocent third party involved. We went through with everything though, because yeah, yeah, Jozar yeah. said he'd be there for the kid, whether Sierra stayed loyal or not. If of course, the baby is his. If it's his, is yeah, the better you know what I'm saying? Anything, being for the we won't know until like, more important. the time so comes up. Loyal, what happens then? If she loved, then I'll apply myself to the situation. But until then, she on thin ice. Hello? Hey, girl. Uh, I just wanted to make sure that we're still on for today to go over choreo. Yeah, I'm still good for it. Okay, perfect. I'm going to head over to the producer's house soon. I'll send you my ATA. 
Okay, see you soon. See you soon. The first step of her plan was getting Sierra to come to this house. So a couple days ago, we had Madeline ask her to create some dance choreography for one of her songs in exchange for some good money. Sierra was interested and even suggested meeting at a dance studio that she frequents. However, as planned, Madeline preferred to meet at her producer's house. Hey, this is nice. This is crazy. They got the rabbit fur carpet. It's crazy. <laughs> Shoot, I feel like I can get used to this. She gonna see this car and that's gonna let me know right there. From She's the gonna car. get the full test right now. She's gonna get the full test. I know, test. right? The million dollar home is gonna make Isaiah look rich, but this $475,000 Rolls Royce is going to add some crazy credibility. Here's yeah, my favorite feature. Bloop. Whoa! Kyle, how much is this umbrella? $3,200. $3,200? Huh? I'm about to be like, hey, how much is the car? How much do you think this umbrella is? That's the flex. I think you can film a Gold Digger video with just the umbrella, bro. <laughs> The owner of this umbrella and the Rolls Royce is our friend Kyle. Today he'll be playing Isaiah's driver. After showing Isaiah how to work the car, setting everything up, and adjusting our plan a bit because of the rain, everyone eventually got into position. So you said you already okay. have baby mama drama? Yeah, I got two kids already. How's it going with the other baby mamas? They pretty cool now. You know, it's, it, be, it was rocky at first, but you know, the best thing about it is they let me see my kids and talk That's to good. my kids. How do you drive this car? This is half a million dollars? You can drive it after afterwards. I don't think you want me to drive it. <laughs> you see the color of my skin, bro? <laughs> <laughs> Hello? Oh, is this it? I think this is it. Okay, perfect. Um, I have parking in the driveway for you. I just found some street parking. I'm like super close. Just park in the driveway because I don't want you to get towed. They usually start towing cars around four. Oh, really? Just pull into the driveway. I'm coming out right now. Where is that her? She's right there, yeah. Okay, we're starting, we're starting, we're starting. Madeline had to convince Sierra to park in the driveway. Okay, pulling up right now. Do you I see, see me. Oh, okay, that. Cool. Yeah. Let's pull up right here. Right there. Right here? Yeah. There we go. She's parking in the driveway. Perfect. This was a simple but important task. You guys will see how we use this to our advantage later. Nice to finally meet you. Okay. How was the drive? Oh, actually, not too bad. Thank God it stopped raining. Okay, here we go. The shot begins. We have so much, so much work to do, but yeah. One thing at a time. Yeah, you know? exactly. Um, we could just, I already set up the mirror here. I was thinking we could just do here. Oh, this is the producer. Hey. How's it going? Nice to meet you. Isaiah. All right, they met, first contact. Uh, if you wanna just put your stuff down. Yeah. We, yeah, yeah. yeah uh -oh. Madeline now had to make this entire thing believable. So before they start working on the dance choreo for her song, she makes small talk with Sierra, all while Isaiah pretends to get work done. We could do like something for TikTok, something pretty short. It doesn't have to be like super, you know, like, crazy, yeah. you know? Yeah. I mean, we could just start. Get into it. We yeah. could just. Eventually, the girls move on to creating the choreo. Yeah, we're just gonna give them some time here to do their thing, and then I'm gonna be giving Madeline a call and getting her out of the scene. I got legends watching me get done dirty. That's crazy. <laughs> <laughs> Turning Man, into that's crazy. Right now, watching this shit happen. Yep, yep, I know, right? Have you ever owned a Honda Civic? Yes, I have owned a Honda Civic. Okay, okay. I started off broke just like everyone. <laughs> <laughs> everybody did. Not everybody just grew into, you know, she the money like that. She's going to Madeline at the end of this. <laughs> <laughs> I know, dude, how does Madeline feel that she's getting so friendly with her? It's funny, though. Now that I've settled down, more girls hit on me now than I did when I was single. But it's getting your loyal. Like, around. Sergio and I are going to come out with the camera. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> if we don't like you, we can just, you know, change it. Change yeah, moves. Like... If she passes the test, do you plan on telling her that this was a test? Or would you? Nah. Some things are better left unsaid. I feel it. I feel it. She'll never come across this video. And if she does, remember, guys, you deny, deny, deny. Matter. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I was just so high, I don't even remember. <laughs> <laughs> the dance was coming out pretty nice, and so was the sun. After 45 minutes, it was time to move things along. <gasps> Ooh. My manager's calling me, hold up. Hello? Oh, uh, hey Madeline, you got some time to talk? Otherwise, your music video might not happen. Yes, give me one second, give me one second. I gotta oh. take this. Yeah, yeah, go ahead, no worries. Okay, hey, I'll be right back. Give me like 10, 15 minutes. She crazy. And just like that, we got Madeline out of there. We were one step closer to Isaiah making his move. She left you for a manager? Huh, you ain't had to say it like that. The can am Riker. Yeah. yeah. You can't tie her down for too long. That girl stays busy. I saw what you guys are doing though. It's looking good. You like 
Yeah, it's all the little, I, I'm not gonna do it, I can't dance. <laughs> How long you been dancing for? Honestly, like my entire life. Alrighty, Kyle, go ahead and make your entrance, over. You uh, you dance full time right now? Yeah, uh, I've been super blessed to get like, you about to dance back to back. That's dope. Yeah, so you produce like all of the I wouldn't say all of it. We have like 20 something songs together. I produced this track. Really? Yeah. Appreciate it. No, she's really good. How long have you been uh, making music? Not as long as most people that I know. Mm. I've only been doing it for like seven years. So it's like, it's yeah. Still a long time. Yeah. It's a lot of work, but yeah. we love it. Yeah. This is your slot? Yeah. Yeah. It's beautiful. Appreciate it. She real f***ing curious. Been here for like two yeah, years. Yeah, she. Really? Mm hmm. I love it here. Yeah. yeah. She her the fact that she even entertaining this conversation alone is already a red flag. Ideally, what would you want her to say or do? That she here for business that ain't got nothing to do with her. Madeline ain't in the room. She's supposed to be minding her business. Mm -hmm. You do anything other than dance? You play any sports growing up? Yeah, actually. Yeah. What's up, What's up my guy? What's, What's happening, bro? How's she looking? Dude, your car still looks fresh, I mean. The car wash was closed, but oh, the man. inside needs some work. It's a little wet, but works. Cool. So there's a car that's blocking the drive by the Dodge Charger. Oh yeah, that's my car. Do you mind if I move it? I'm gonna move it in really quickly and then I'll put the Rolls Royce right behind it. Oh, I can just move it. I got it. I mean, it will be a tight squeeze, if, so I would rather just not any of the cars get scratched and I'll just do got it. Got you. Perfect, you guys wanna come out with me? Sure. He does this thing for a living, by the way. You don't exactly. have to. Exactly, I detail <laughs> cars, not manage cars. Okay. Uh-oh. Here we go. Madeline convinced Sierra to park in the driveway so that we could force her to come back outside without even trying. So yeah, okay, okay, that makes sense. Right that makes sense. Sierra thinks that Kyle is just driving her car into the garage so that he could then pull in Isaiah's car into the driveway. While technically, yes, this is true, it's not the main reason why we dragged her out here. Perfect, thank you so much. Yeah. Let me move this one right in. As I mentioned earlier, Kyle is pretending to be Isaiah's driver who just got his car detailed. That's my baby right there. You like it? Yeah, it looks really nice. The car was supposed to be super clean. Isaiah was supposed to be impressed by Kyle's work and then tip him a generous amount. But because of the rain, it didn't make sense to do that anymore. Funny enough though, the sun ended up coming out after all. I would say I can take you on a drive, but I don't know if Madeline would be happy if I took you away. So <laughs> we, <laughs> she did leave you though, I don't know. No, we can hop inside. Yeah. Oh, we can for sure go inside. All right, here we go. Our new plan was for Isaiah to simply invite Sierra to check out the inside of the car, which he did flawlessly. I got you. Really? Yeah. I don't want to eat it. Appreciate you. Of course, let me get you your key, bro. Damn. She's, she see the car and she choosing already. Isaiah effortlessly gets Sierra into the car. And I didn't notice this at the time, but when she hops into the car, she immediately starts checking herself out. Is oh, she checking trying to make sure she out. looks good? Is she just fixing her hair from all the dancing? I don't know. What do you guys wow. think? This is a red flag. Yeah, it's a red flag. Yourself. You look good. <laughs> With Sierra now in the Rolls Royce, there was only one last step in our plan. Isaiah was now free to finally make his move. How do you think she's doing so far? Yeah. She on thin ice and it's cracking. Wow. She still ain't made any actions that she can't come back from, but she's entertaining too much for sure right now. Simple fact that she's sitting in the car already about enough. I had them do the interior custom made. On the back right here, you can't really see, mm -hmm. but if you push these buttons, yeah. that pops out like that. Ooh, yeah. <laughs> That's nice. This is my second car. I got the other car in the shop. Oh, wow. But I like driving this one oh, a lot. Nice. This is my baby. Yeah, is this like your dream car or? Oh, for sure. <laughs> yeah, it costs way too much to not be my dream car. How much is it? Guess. I don't want any no cars like that. <laughs> Just by looking at it. I would say maybe like a hundred thousand. Ha! You say a hundred thousand? Yeah, one thousand. Is there more? Less? That is crazy. That's wow. You really said a hundred thousand dollars? Does it cost a hundred thousand? <laughs> like. <laughs> Am I wrong? I feel insulted. That's, that's wild. I told you I don't know cars like that. <laughs> it costs 400000 Yeah. 400000 mm -hmm. No way this car Swear to God. Uh, yeah. Much. Yeah. You're lying. What do I got to lie for? $400,000? That's literally the price of a house. I never actually thought about it like that. Here we 
go. Here we go. So now Sierra knows the price of the car, which side note is actually $475,000 before taxes. And yes, that includes the umbrella. So, uh, get here we go from here. I'm like 40 minutes now. Yeah? Not too far. That's not far at all. Yeah, not too far. Yeah. You got any plans this weekend? I don't know yet. Why? Well, I guess, sir. I'm just trying to give you some plans. Yeah. Give me some plans. I'm gonna be real. Yeah, be real. I'm in a predicament right now. What? I got this beautiful woman in my car. Oh. And I feel like I would be dumb not to ask her out on a date. Oh, She'd shit. Be dumb to say yes. That's a nice, yeah, ooh, that's a nice one. I would love to. Well, why do you want to take me out on a date? Because you're beautiful, you're talented, mm -hmm. you're sexy. The list goes on. I can keep going if you want me to. I want someone I can spend my time with, give my time to. Mm. I want to spend my time with you. She don't even know when people lie to her. That's she making it easy for them too. I'll pick you up in this. I'll have a whole bouquet of flowers in the back. Flowers? I'll make a song for you. A song. For the me? whole nine. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, you. Yeah. Put your number on my phone. Okay. We can figure whatever out. Say less. Say less, she says. Already. Damn. Like she ain't pregnant. That's what she on. Um, you think she'd actually show up? It don't matter if she's showing. Just opening the door, giving them access, that's already enough. This is crazy because Sierra is pregnant. She's pregnant. She's in a relationship with Joe's heart because she wants to be a family. Yet she's over here agreeing and go on dates with other guys. Okay. Where do you want to eat? Honestly, I have no idea. Like, I'm usually pretty indecisive. Oh, got you, Miss Indecisive. Just pick. You, you pick. I All right. Spicy food? Like, I don't know. We can do spicy food. How about this? I'll pick you up. Okay. We can be spontaneous. Okay. We can figure it out on the day, and then after, we can come back, chill. Like, come back to here? Yeah. At your crib? At my crib. <laughs> but, yeah. Yeah. Oh. Lord, hammer. She ready. Look at her just choosing. Though. What the f wrong with this? I can make some drinks. I'm actually kind of nice. I actually used to be a bartender back in the day. No I'm kind of nice with it, yeah. Before I started doing this producer thing. No way. Yeah. <laughs> There's no way. Mm -hmm. What do you know how to make? Once again, Isaiah decided to push this phase even further, and this time it seems to be working out for him. I can make whatever you like. Mm. What do you like drinking? More of like a tequila gown. Okay. You know? What are we rocking with the tequila? Mm, margarita. Tequila sunrise sometimes. Okay, I already got the pineapple juice and that orange juice in the fridge right now. Oh, so you just ready. Oh, I stay ready. You stay ready, you don't gotta get ready, you feel me? Yeah. <laughs> she's she talking about Man. drinking while she's supposed to be pregnant. What? Yeah, that's, that's the true. key thing. That's true, damn, I didn't even that's know that. about to say. That we can, you know, just see where the night goes. Okay. I'll be down with whatever. Yeah, I like being spontaneous. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, like what? She don't got no respect for herself. Yo. She's making it so easy. This was a complete and utter fail. Sierra knows exactly what Isaiah's offering and she knows what she should say. Yet despite having a man and a baby, she still agrees to go on a date with him. It looks like she's looking for a come up. Ain't they all? All right, where am I picking you up from? You said you live in what area? She's really doing all of this while she's pregnant, dude. She got a man yes. and a baby, bro. What's she that's gonna the, do when the dude the... finds out she has a baby? I can't even imagine what she'd be doing on a normal. That's just really crazy as to think of all that. You really can't just trust people, and that's why I'm glad I did this because this just gave me the confirmation that she ain't loyal for sure. So that gave me more reason to keep my suspicions going of who baby it is. Yeah. It's cool though, bro. And you definitely want to get her tested before you put in any child support or anything. Oh, 100%, dude. 1,000%. 100%, sure. dude. This is heartbreaking, yeah. messed up, and sad. It's sad for Joe's art and the baby. Like, really think about it. Definitely mm -hmm. hurt enough. No point in continuing this any further? No, no she, she, need to, she need to feel me. She need to see how I feel. No, she clearly too comfortable in the car. She's too comfortable in this environment. I need to... 
yeah. wake her up and bring her back to reality. Her head in La La Land right now, so she really for the streets though. Like, well, I'm hey, right yeah. the car. You want her to come back? Oh to no, touch. we right to the car. We right can't give her a chance to try to lie about it. We gotta catch her right now. Damn it, she's blocked in too. Her car's blocked in, oh, so yeah, she, she can't she, go she anywhere. Can't go nowhere. Oh. Nowhere. I just did it. Nah. Yeah. The outcome of this video was unfortunate, but on the bright side, though, if Isaiah does end up being the dad, at least it's good to know that he's going to step up and be there for his kid. I hope you guys have your talkies because you guys already know. It's going to be good. This it's going to be good. Here we go. And so it begins. What the f is this, bruh? Wrong with you? What the f is this? You know what the f this is. Who why the f you talking about? You about to go on a date with this nigga? What the f going through your hair right now? What? Why the f you all here being a? F What's your problem? Yo, can you stop recording me? No, I'm not about to stop recording you. What the f you all here doing? You in his car talking about you about to go on dates this time and third? What the f wrong with you? You tripping? You think I'm stupid or something? You look stupid. No, I don't look stupid. I don't oh my god. You got going See, on. the disrespect. No. No, 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 no. See, see. <laughs> This shit way over her head and she got me fucked up. She gonna sit up there and think that, oh yeah, I look stupid. Chick, no, no, no. We're not doing all that. No, no sassiness, no nothing. You in the wrong. No need for you to for the back talking nothing like that. Cause that shit crazy. That's crazy, man. That's crazy. She's sitting out here acting like that. It's straight up crazy. Shorty. I'm over this shit, nah, what the f Oh, you going? over? Out of my way. Where the f you going? We're not about to do that. You trying to run away from your problems and no, your I'm responsibilities. Not to run away. I'm not trying to be in on camera, bro. Bro, you shouldn't have been out here being a What the f you doing there? You talking about you're not trying to be on camera. I'm not trying to be out here raising a kid that ain't mine. You want me to be there and be responsible for this kid and be there for this baby? But you out here doing niggas and like that? You got me up. What the f are you talking about? You know, I know what right? I'm talking about. You out here in the car playing crazy with this talking about you about to go on dates. And you talking about you about to drink liquor? You got a baby in your belly. You know what that that's gonna do to my kid? What the is wrong with you? You not thinking about she don't have one. I can do whatever the I want to do. You're not about to do what the you want while you got my kid in your belly. Supposedly, my baby. What the <laughs> wrong Bro, with you? you set me up. Yeah, I set you up because you was about to set me up for 18 years. About to have me paying child support on a kid that's probably what not the even. What the are you talking about? Bro? I'm talking about you this baby and you hiring people to stop me. Nah, don't be trying to flip this shit on me. Nah, I saw all these cameras out here because you could have been one, two, three, four, five niggas before you told me you had this baby in your stomach. Sierra, Sierra, this entire thing was basically all a test. We were just trying to help Joe's art find out if you were loyal to him or not. That's why we have all these cameras. Failed, rolling. tragically. I mean, and clearly, I mean, you agreed to go on a date with Isaiah. This isn't actually his house. This house is a rental. Wow. Madeline is a singer, but she doesn't really want to make a whole dance and everything for the video. So like all that was just made up. Like, you know, we just wasting my so I'm not gonna get my money. <laughs> now you know how I feel to get your yeah, time well, wasted. Why the f do you have everyone in our business? I tried to keep it between me and you, but you wanted to involve all these other niggas in our situation. Now I'm just questioning who you was dealing with before you even told me you was pregnant, because it might not even be mine. Exactly. Hey. I want a paternity test. Well, it's not. It's not yours. It's not your baby. Yeah. Did you want to hear that? So they my baby. And that's exactly what we were just saying. We were just not just saying that. That a possibility that it ain't. It's not. You know what? No more talk. <laughs> it's a wrap. You know. Who kid it's a wrap. Dude? I f***ed your best friend. <gasps> I f***ed your friend. Hey, look. How does what that feel? the hell? Did you want to hear that? Yeah. I your friend. Yo, you straight up. You straight up, bitch, for that one, yo. Straight up, yo. That's messed up. Hey, look. You know we don't even play like that. Don't even say no like that to me before I get out of here. Nah. You up in the head, shorty. How about this? I mean, I know you're worried about getting paid, so how about if I offer you a thousand dollars to go take a prenatal pregnancy test? There's a few clinics. Who are you? <laughs> I'm Joe's Art's friend here, and I'm trying to just get to the truth at this point. My offer to you is I'll give you a thousand dollars if you agree to go do a prenatal pregnancy test. It's gonna cost about two thousand dollars, but I'll cover all of that. You'll get pretty much a thousand dollars for taking the test. He'll know who's the actual if he's the father or not, and everything else is covered. <laughs> wait, wait, what? So you're offering to pay her? I'll give her an extra five thousand dollars. I gave her six grand total. Six grand. <laughs> so you'll give Whoa! Her an extra five grand. That's yes. Awesome. Six grand. This came out of nowhere. My man. Yeah, that came out of nowhere. Sierra six thousand dollars to take this thing called a prenatal pregnancy test. Now I didn't know this at the time, but apparently they've developed ways to find out if you're the parent of a child before the baby's even born. Apparently, as early as seven weeks of conception. Imagine if Jerry and Maury had this. Six grand. 
Six grand. Six K. You look. I'm over this, bro. I'm over this. Oh, where you going, shorty? Just getting. Why you trying to leave? He said he about to pay for everything. You can't go nowhere like. Touch me, bro. Like, I'm out of here, bro. How you trying to leave now? He probably called her blood. What's your issue, shorty? Come back. Don't away from your problems now. You lack accountability. I think, I think he called her bluff, though. He called her bluff because of the fact that he threw in the prenatal, the prenatal, pre, you know, um, DNA test and everything like that. I think he called her bluff. Because he want he wanted to see what she was gonna do about that. Yes, he's a good Samaritan. He wants to sit up there and and want to see if that's his child or not or whatever like that. But ultimately, I think he called her bluff. Because if it's not if it's a baby in her, or she knows that it's not his or whatever like that, why didn't she take the money and why didn't she take the test? And my thing is, she probably already know whose it is or whatever like that and stuff, but. She decided just not, you know, it's not worth it or whatever like that. But we're going to, hopefully he'll say, they'll say something about that. Because I think he called her bluff. With everything you do and now you're trying to run away when the evidence right in front of you. That's a problem. Camera. You need to find out your morals and your standards. They in the gutter. You see what you You. You is the problem. Oh, we got to move the rolls. Hey, we should move that before she backs into it. Holy. <laughs> let me let me go move this car real quick. I left the uh, the keys are in the car. Yo, class. She was like, just, we could just let her go, bro. Cause she we gonna let her go, but she's still up. Like, you out here choosing uh, with these niggas like I'm. A, I've been taking care of you the from the start of all of this. You got a six k opportunity. Let let her struggle, bro. Don't rush for nothing. Don't don't let her control the that she got going on. She don't run over here. Hey, she might back up into the rolls, bro. <laughs> yeah, move, yeah, move the, yeah, move the car. Just move the car. I hate to see it. that. Nut it in. You're. A Oatmeal cream pie. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> that really called oatmeal cream pie. What the? What does that yeah. even mean? Oatmeal oh, cream you, pie. Come on, Judy, man. You know what that miss me, man, bro. Don't even play that, yo. You know what it means. I guess I kind of get it. Come on, you kind of get going it. Big. Play the official. Yeah. What's wrong with her? Now, despite being offered $6,000 to take this prenatal test, Sierra refused to take it. Why? I don't know. Maybe it's because of her ego. Maybe it's because she knows it's not Joe's arts. Or maybe it's because of what she says next. Joke's on you. There's no baby. Bye. See? Yeah. I told you. I told you. I told you. <laughs> she really just said He that. called her called bluff. Yeah, I don't called know if she's being on serious there. or not, but uh, she just said there was no baby. She just said there's no Baby? She said there's no baby. No way. You said you recorded it. You got it on yeah, camera. No. Oh, yeah, way. we got it. You got to yeah, spin yeah. that back for me. So you telling me? So you telling? So you telling me that it ain't no baby? There, there is no baby in the first place. Oh yeah, hey, careful, hey, careful. Josar, come back here, Josar. There's no baby in the first place. Yeah, don't, don't, don't Man, let her. Please yeah, don't. don't. What the fuck is wrong with you? You, take your ass on somewhere. Let's see that footage. I want to see that footage. I don't rule out the possibility that there really is no baby, but I don't know. She's super mad. She might just be talking out of her ass. This revelation is shocking, but I kind of take it with a grain of salt. Like, what is even the truth at this point? I don't Man. know all the, the being thrown out, but <laughs> this is why you. <laughs> he just in there. She was basically just about to play me. I don't know, bro. Just to try to like get the bread out of me, bro. Like, you think she's being honest there? I don't know. I'm a little 50-50. It's a little too mad. She, she she's she's been she's she's she only told me about a month or two ago, so I can't even tell by the stomach if she really pregnant or not. I feel like she was trying to with you the whole confrontation because she she was telling you, oh, the baby's not yours, I fed your friend, and now she's telling you there is no baby. Yep. I think anything is possible at this point. What does get me is the whole like, why didn't she take the the money? I took exactly. that as like, dude, if she was telling the truth, why wouldn't she just say exactly? It? She's telling the truth. It's great. Thank you. Exactly. Even if she is telling the truth, she's done for in the in the case of me feeling any feelings for her. Even if she's pregnant and the kid is mine, she just gonna have to learn how to deal with it from a distance. Gonna co-parent and not get my kid on my own time. There you go.
Ну, чому? Ока. Well, he, 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 he ain't trying to get whipped. He ain't trying to get back with her like that, so. I hope not. That means this is this this is the craziest one I've seen yet. Boy. Yo, like seriously, this chick is crazy. Like she's sitting out here talking about some that's his baby and then turn around, oh, I slept with your friend. And then ultimate the ultimate thing, homie just set up this flat out just get offer her like six thousand dollars cash take the test and just to have extra but she didn't take it and we we're left we're left stuck why she didn't take it and she basically just said stuff out out of her ass about there's no baby well out of all them three we don't even know what's true or not but like you saw in the video she came back wanting to talk to me Pretty much, you might as well say that's that's the end. That's a wrap for that. You know, ain't no coming back from that. Nah.